Hello, in this video I will show you how many widgets have the, has the plugin. So, the plugin has three widgets. Mine widget, widget WooCommerce Currency Switcher. Let's drop it. With its options, so its title, its width, you can set in the pixels or in the percents. Show flags, uh, it's all an option of the widget. So, if you will decide that you want to hide flags in this widget, you can uncheck it. Flags position, left, right, works for DD Slick skin only. Drop down options, text type, code it, all description. Let me show what does it mean. So let's save it. So we have drop down options text type as code. What does it mean? In the drop down will be displayed these currency codes. Let's look at it. Let's refresh the page. We can see here currency codes with its their symbols. Let's select description. Save. Refresh the page. And you will see that instead of currency codes uh, displayed its description. By the way, if description field is empty, add with GBP will be displayed its code, as you can see. So it's just enough right there, for example, pound. Any word you want, I mean. Refresh the page and you will see that all is on its places. So, decide yourself what you want to see in your switcher drop-down. Okay, uh, next two widgets. So, uh, there is, the plugin has two uh, widgets, a commerce currency converter, another useful widget, allows your users to convert any amounts from one currency to another. And next last widget is uh, WooCommerce currency rates. Rates, okay, it's here. Uh, so let's look at it. WooCommerce currency rates just shows rates for the selected currency. So your users can see what currency rates you are applying for your prices. All works in a Jax modem. Let's look these widgets options. As you can see, they both have the same options. For example, you want to exclude, uh, I don't know for any reason, GBP for, from the converter. Just press, uh, just uh, drop this currency code in this text field, refresh the page. and you will not see this currency here the same way here say next precision so uh, how many decimals shows in the currency rate or in currency converter results so you can so set here for example to let's make it so now you can see only two decimals the same here two decimals so that is all it's three simple widgets and I have no information about them see you bye